Now I have access to Sora, the most powerful text to video generation model released by OpenAI. The videos are really stunning as you can see here. These are the hand-picked videos. Bring your imagination to life with text, image or video. You can remix. When asked to open large doors in the library, you can automatically generate that for you. If you want to replace the doors with French doors, then it's replaced. Then turn the library into a spaceship. Then it turns like this. Then remove the spaceship and add jungle. Then that will look like this. Replace the jungle with the lunar view and that will look like this. You can recut the image with storyboard like feature. It will create a timeline like feature at the bottom where you can select your video. Based on the position, it will try to create videos on the empty space. You can create storyboard with different sets like this. You can create loops both opening the flower and after opening, this is going to close back again, which you can generate. Combine two videos into one seamless clip. Left hand side, you got one video. On the right hand side, you got another video and you can blend those two videos. You've got style presets. Based on the style which you prompt, it can automatically generate the video for you, as you can see here. Sora testing. We are going to test Sora and find if this is the future of AI video generation. We'll be testing how the legs are moving in the video, how are the fingers, object consistency, shadow accuracy, physics simulation, text rendering, and multiple people interaction. Gladly, it's also available in ChatGPT Plus account, which means you are able to directly create the videos today for a maximum of 50 priority videos, up to 720 pixel resolution and five second duration. But for pro users, it's 500 priority videos, unlimited relaxed videos, up to 1080p resolution, 20 second duration and five concurrent generations. You are able to download without watermark for the ChatGPT Pro users. And here is the user interface. You got multiple options here. Recent, featured, saved, all videos, favorites, uploads. The recent tab will show you the most recent created videos, as you can see here. Next, the featured, particularly selected, filtered, top quality results. Also, you can save any of these by clicking the save icon and it'll get saved to the saved panel. All my videos will be shown here and my favorites will be here and I can even upload my own picture and extend it from there. So the upload section is here. You can also categorize your video by creating new new folders like this. I can just say testing. Many people start creating the videos and that will appear in the most recent tab. So if you want to create something like this, a futuristic farming innovation, I should be clearly see the prompt which is used to generate this and I can even recreate the whole video using this prompt. Here you can edit, recut the video, remix the video, blend the video with another video and also create loops. For example, if I like this dragon video, I'm going to click this and here is the prompt. A dragon with saddle at the base of her neck and a dragon rider with a blue fired engulfed sword. So I've got few options here. I can upload an image for reference, just uploading an image of a dragon. You can choose the aspect ratio as per your requirement. I'm keeping 69. Resolution also I'm keeping 480p to get fastest generation. Duration 5 seconds. I can generate multiple videos at once, like 4 videos, 2 videos and 1. To keep this quicker, I'm just going to generate 1 and then click create video. So here is the video which got generated from image, prompt and text prompt all together. And this brings a slight movement to the picture which I have uploaded. Next, we are going to see about storyboard feature. If I like this video or it could be even one of the video which you have just generated. So after that, you have an option here view and edit storyboard for this video. So I can just click that and it will automatically bring up this storyboard where you are able to write your own prompt. So this is the prompt which was written before to generate that video. Similarly, here is another prompt for the storyboard. So the remaining part of the storyboard is automatically generated. So I can even add more storyboard section and I can just say make it fly in the sky. So that is a storyboard option. So you can keep on adding it up to maximum of five seconds. 
if you have set 5 seconds here. If I increase that to 20 seconds, you can generate up to 20 seconds video. But for now, I'm going to stick with 5 seconds, 480p, one video, and then just create. That is storyboard. A easy way to create a lengthy video with multiple changes in that one video. And you can predefine it. If you let AI design what to do in the next scene, it could be random, but we want fixed. So this will help you to do that. And here is a storyboard video, which we ask it to generate. And seems like towards the end, it's not flying, but maybe I might need to modify the prompt to make it much better. So first we are going to test legs articulation, how the legs are the legs accurate. So here's the prompt, a ballet dancer gracefully performing showcasing precise leg movements and clicking generate and here's the video let's look at the legs so at this point when you see slowly the legs are not properly formed so that is not accurate for a normal eyes we won't notice that but when we look more keenly then you should be able to find the issue next fingers dexterity a close-up of a pianist's hands skillfully playing a grand piano highlighting finger movements and this is that video the fingers are not 100% accurate and you can just see the hands going up and down and also in the shadow seems like it's slightly off next object consistency a red ball bouncing across a wooden floor maintaining its shape color throughout the scene and here is the video the ball is jumping over the floor and it's keeping its shape consistent also the shadows looks consistent that is really good next shadows accuracy a cyclist riding through a city street at sunset with the realistic dynamic shadows cast on the pavement and here is the rider riding the bike you can see the shadows clearly on the ground overall this is more realistic next physics simulation a glass of water tipping over on a table with the liquid spilling and reacting naturally to gravity. But not sure if it understood the actual prompt. The water is coming, but it is outside the cup and it's over the table. It is reacting to gravity, but the physics is not maintained in this video. Next, text rendering. A person writing the phrase Mervyn Prison on a whiteboard in clear, legible handwriting. And here is the video. It's trying to write, but the accuracy is not there. So I can see the pen is not touching the board and automatically the writings are appearing. Also, I can see a spelling mistake there. And finally, multiple people interaction. A group of friends having a lively conversation around a bonfire at night with natural interactions and moments. And here is a group of friends having a lively conversation during bonfire night. So the things what we can notice here is that the fingers again, the hands, the way it's coming together and for random reason they are moving their hands, their head with no consistency. Overall, the abstraction generation like this, also the cartoon generation is more realistic compared to the normal videos. If it's a cartoon, it's more like an artistic feature in that video and we wouldn't naturally recognize that. Overall, this is a really good model compared to other models I have tried, and this only gets better. So if you are an animator or cartoon creator, this is definitely a good start. Eventually, this is going to get better with all natural physics and every consistency. And I'm really excited about this. Do let me know in the comments below what you think about this. Considering you already like this OpenAI release, I've also created another video in regards to OpenAI Pro mode release, which I'll put the link in here and I highly recommend for you to watch and I will see you there.